Yay, thanks for ever joining me, everybody. Thanks for joining us. I'm so glad to hear you. Hi, John. Rock and roll. Hi, Rosie. Hi, Lexi. Okay. Everybody's Good. online. Hey, Thomas, how you guys doing? Sandra. Yes. This is my talk. This is my boy button. Hey, David. How are you doing, David? All right. Come on over here, Nate. Say hi to everybody. You guys all know Nate Phelps, right? Say hi, everybody. This, this is my preacher. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> yeah, you ain't no preacher, man. <laughs> right, right. All right, so we are live, and we're good, and my microphone is on, and now... Uh, all I have to do. Um, right in the sun. Eh? Yeah, we're just about ready. We are just about ready. All right, let's get married. Hi, baby. Hi. Thank you. How are yours? Thank you so much. <laughs> I'll take it for you. <laughs> Too fast, but then we're going to do it anyways. Go ahead. What? Ask me about house. House. You look awesome. The rings, you got a ring over there? Hold on. You got a ring, you got a ring. Yeah. We're ready to rock. All right. Hi, everybody. Hi. <laughs> Thank okay. you for joining us. Everybody, we're gathered here today to witness the formal joining of David Phillips Silverman and Christine Marie Shelska. Yeah. <laughs> sure, I got the middle name right. Yeah. In the legal state of matrimony, you're to be married according to the orders, customs, and the authority granted by the government of the province of Alberta. Matrimony is understood by us as a state enriched by a long and honorable tradition of devotion. According to the law, each participant is equal and supports the common rights of one another in the marriage. Marriage is not just a ceremony here today. It's a commitment for life. Therefore, it's not to be entered into thoughtlessly or irresponsibly. There must be a desire for lifelong companionships. Companionship. Couples will support and comfort each other through the changing experiences of life. May you laugh together in joy, grieve together in sorrow, and grow together in love. Marriage means caring as much about the welfare and happiness of your marriage partner as about your own well-being. Marriage also means working together to create and sustain a home in which the marriage may flourish. With this understanding, David Philip Silverman and Christine Marie Shelska wish to be joined in marriage. Therefore, if any persons can show just and sufficient reason why these two persons may not be joined in matrimony, let them now declare reasons or else from this time forward, keep their peace. Any complaints? <laughs> okay, I now call upon you both in the presence of these witnesses to repeat after me. In unison? What's that? In unison? No. Okay. We'll do one at a time. Yeah. Okay. So, Christina, this for you. I do solemnly declare that I do not know of any lawful impediment why I, Christine Marie Shelska. I do solemnly declare that I do not know of any legal impediment. Why I, why I Christine, Marie, Christine Marie Shelska, may not be joined in matrimony. May not be joined in matrimony. To David Philip Silverman. To David Philip Silverman. And now, David, mm -hmm. I do solemnly declare that I do not know of any lawful impediment. I do solemnly declare that I do not know of any lawful impediment. Why I, David Philip Silverman. Why I, David Philip Silverman. May not be joined in matrimony to Christine Marie Shelska. May not be joined in matrimony to Christine Marie Shelska. Okay. As no impediment was declared or admitted, I require you to give answers to these questions. Do you, David Philip Silverman, promise to give Christine Marie Shelska the love of your person, the comfort of your companionship, and the patience of your understanding? Will you share with her equally the necessities of life as they may be earned or enjoyed by yourself and to respect the dignity of her own personal rights? Yes. 
Okay. Do you, Christine Marie Shelska, promise to give David Philip Silverman the love of your person, comfort of your companionship, and the patience of your understanding? Will you share with him equally the necessity of life as they may be earned or enjoyed by yourself and to respect the dignity of his own personal rights? I do. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Well, this is the other legal requirement. <laughs> Do we want to do our vows? We both in that. Now would David and Christina please face one another, join hands, and repeat after me. <laughs> hey, David, I call on these persons present to witness that I, David Philip Silverman. I call on these persons in witness to witness that I, David Philip Silverman. To take you, Christine Marie Shelska. To take you, Christine Marie Shelska. To be my lawful wedded wife. To be my lawful wedded wife. To have and to hold from this day forward. To have and to hold from this day forward. And whatever circumstances or experiences life may hold for us. And whatever circumstances or experiences life may hold for us. Hey, Christine, I call on those persons present to witness that I. I call on those persons. I call on those persons present to witness that I, Christine, Christine Marie Shelska. To take you, David Philip Silverman. Do you take you, David Philip Silverman? To be my lawful wedded husband. To be my lawful wedded husband. To have and to hold from this day forward. To have and to hold from this day forward. In whatever circumstances or experiences life may hold for us. In whatever circumstances or experience, experiences that life may hold for us. Hmm. Okay. Now at this time you guys have your own vows you want to say? We do. You want to go first? You want sure. To go? I'm so proud. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so proud and privileged to marry you, David Phillips, the man of my dreams and the love of my life. This love is obvious and forever. I promise to love, cherish, honor, and protect you, to always treat you with respect, compassion, patience, and understanding. I promise to continue to nurture and foster the beautiful relationship we're, we've cultivated. <clears throat> Whatever future, whatever our future holds, all the best as well as life's challenges, I'll always be by your side. Queer Bulbous, because it's you, because it's us. I love you now, crap. That was beautiful. Thank you. My dear Chris, for over a dozen years you've been my great friend and now that our relationship has evolved, it's obvious, as we say, that you are now my great love. I'm so happy to feel this level of profound, beautiful love in my heart, and I'm honored to receive a love this strong from someone as wonderful as you. I promise, Chris, to love, honor, and cherish you for the rest of my life, but our love is special, and so I want my vows to go just a little bit beyond that. I also promise to do you right, to be deeply honest with you, and more importantly, I promise to not res repeat mistakes I've made in the past. I promise to protect this precious relationship with every fiber of my being forever. Finally, Chris, I promise to spoil you in every way possible, not because you demand it, but because I do. I will work hard to fill your life with love and romance, encouragement and experiences, fun and happiness. In other words, I will give you the well-lived life and the well-loved love that I think you deserve for the rest of my life, because it's obvious, because it's you. I'm not supposed to get you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we have the rings now. Got one ring right here. Okay. Start with what? Start with you. Do you okay. Want to the ring on her finger. Yes, I do. After me. Yes. I give you this ring that you may wear it. I give you this ring that you may wear it. As a lasting reminder of our marriage vows. As a lasting reminder of our marriage vows. And as a symbol of my love and commitment to you. And as a symbol of my love and commitment to you. Did you throw it? No. <laughs> yeah. I give you this ring that you may wear it. I give you this ring that you may wear it. It's a lasting reminder of our marriage vows. It's a lasting reminder of our marriage vows. And as a symbol of my love and commitment to you. As 
symbol of my love and commitment to you. Okay, David Philip Silverman and Christine Marie Shelska, you have consented in marriage and have declared your solemn intentions in this company before these witnesses and in my presence. You have exchanged these rings as the pledge of your love to each other and you've joined your hands to accept one another. Now upon the authority vested in me by the province of Alberta, I pronounce you husband and wife. Can this we kiss me? Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Yes, thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, everybody. Oh, thank we got to do the dance. Oh, the toast. Right? Oh, the, well, yeah. we got to do the toast. We don't have we're champagne. Do so I'll, I'll, I guess I'll do it. <laughs> uh, so, so this is a special toast that we've been we that we've been ha uh, doing for a while. One of the fun little things that we have, one of the little fun little sayings that we have as a couple, is to the fuck us. Yep. And so, so we, we would like to do our to the fuck us toast. And of course, the response for everybody yeah. would be to the fuck you. Right. Right. right? <laughs> so everybody, please join us in a toast. Wait, get in the, get in yeah. the thing here. Oh, yeah. That's right. Oh, yeah. Oh. To the fuck us. To the fuck us. <laughs> Yay. We're fucking married. We're I fucking love married. I love you. <laughs> Let's party. We're going right. to party. Thanks for joining us. Thanks for joining us, everybody. We love you. We appreciate you. We're sorry you couldn't be here in person, but we really do appreciate you being here on video. What? It's bubbling. It's bubbling. <laughs> We're going to go have dinner and drink. And thank you. Thank you, everybody. And uh, we'll see you sometime real soon. We love you all. Thank you so much. Bye. bye. Thank, you. thank you, bye. Mm -hmm. right. Congratulations. Thank you. Oh, I saw Michael, I think, and Michael and Autumn. Who else was in there? Thanks, everybody. You guys rock. Oh, yeah, it's all recorded. All right, let's go eat. Bye-bye, everybody.